I fell behind, guys, and I'm sorry about that. It's been at least two weeks since I did my last vlog. Um, but we finally have things to kind of talk about and update you on. So I brought you with me to the park because uh, I found this great little park called Majestic View Park. I'll show you guys in a little while why it's called that right now. I just set up my hammock for the first time in like two and a half years and I'm enjoying sitting in it. Yeah, so today, today I went and did a bunch of scouting, I guess, for ideas and stuff for the wedding, mainly the reception, but also for my adorable little flower girls, trying to figure out what's gonna work for them because a couple of them have uh, fabric sensitivity um, issues, so making sure that kind of what I'm thinking and seeing for their dress is going to be something that actually works for them, that they'll be comfortable in kind of a thing. I found some great ideas. I'm putting together a plan. And Jay and I have the ceremony site picked out. We just have to book it and then uh, because of its location, which I'm not going to tell you guys quite yet. Uh, we're going to have to get a shuttle because it's in the mountains. And we don't want to have to make people <laughs> drive up kind of sketchy uh, mountain roads with full-on switchbacks. And yeah, especially people who aren't used to driving in the mountains. So we're going to get a shuttle to take people up to the ceremony site. It'll be lovely and beautiful. And the really cool thing is this place doesn't need like any decoration because the setting itself is just perfect. Mm. Yeah, you guys will see. Anyway, I think my plan is I'm going to sit here in my hammock for a little while. I brought a couple of different books with me. I brought my headphones. I brought a little Bluetooth speaker. Uh, also brought a couple notebooks because, you know, me, I never know what I want to do. <laughs> I think I'm going to start reading about Gertrude Tommy Tompkins. If you guys don't know who she was. Certifiable badass. And honestly, you should look her up because her story is incredible and inspiring and heartbreaking. She's been a big inspiration to me since I first learned about her about two years ago. So of course, when I found a book a biography of her called Seized by the Sun, I had to get a copy. So I'm going to try and work on that, I think. And then in a little bit, I'm going to come back and I'm going to take you guys on a little walk as I explore this adorable little park some more. I hope you guys have, are having a lovely Tuesday. I know NJ and I are, and even though he's not here with me, we're learning to have alone time away from each other because... Since I left the, my previous job, we've been spending a lot of time together. And with every couple, with any relationship, friendship, sibling, whatever, time apart from each other is important, right? So I'm out here getting my nature on, enjoying my hammock. It's a cute hammock, you see? I show you. It is a Mexican blanket hammock and it's not as wide as like your nylon camping hammocks. I struggle with those honestly because um, I feel claustrophobic in them. They close in around me and I don't like that. So when I saw this one, it's uh, a little bit more narrow than most of the, the nylon camping hammocks I've seen. Um, and with a slightly more heavy-duty fabric, I thought it would be a better fit for me. And it's definitely more colorful. So I will see you guys in a little while. And we will explore this park. And I will show you why it's called Majestic View Park. I promise. So I decided to move my hammock because where I had been... I was underneath some pine trees and the shade was a lot spottier 
that now I have like the perfect spot for my hammock and I know where to set it up in the future. And as far as I can tell, this park doesn't have any rules about not having hanging hammocks, so I can't get in trouble. And besides, I'm protecting the trees. I put a towel down before I put my tree straps up, just in case you were wondering. You can kind of see tree strap wrapped around a towel. There was something on my leg. So anyway, I'm going to get back to relaxing because there's a lovely breeze and it's fairly warm out and it's so good to be outside guys. I needed this. All right, see you again in a bit. Bye. So I promised y'all I'd let you know why they called this Majestic View Park. And it's a little hazy today, but I don't know if you can see them gorgeous Rocky Mountains behind me, but it has this beautiful view out over the Rockies. It looks like there's a small pond. I still haven't fully explored this place. Um, I also didn't get any reading done, but I did get some serious just relaxing and hammock sitting done, so that was important. All right, I'm getting hungry, so I'm gonna head home for the night, and I will see you guys again next week. Bye. Please sit in the suitcase. It's not a suitcase.